you got out? Let's see. What's that mean, man? Something Baca. Harry Potter, Hermione Granger. Well, name it Brixton. Brixton. Baca. There you go. I love how you're still set on that name. You really like that name, huh? Yeah. It's my son. I never had. <laughs> All right. You ready to start our journey? Uh, hot wings. <laughs> All right, let's start our journey. Ah, it appears we are almost ready to depart. It's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to spend on spell casting. I presume you've been practicing the spells we worked on. I have, Professor. Well. I'm quite sure I've never seen anyone take so quickly to a second-hand wand. You'll be a force to be reckoned with when you get your own. Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate you working with me all the time. See you soon. Oh, <laughs> Eleazar! George! Glad my rather cryptic description of our location did not thwart your finding us. I've apparated to more vaguely defined destinations than this. <laughs> Though I confess I may have miscalculated slightly on my first try. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some is in the West End. <laughs> it's been much too long. When I received your owl, I must uh, say I... Best not speak here, Eleazar. Mm -hmm. Of course. Why don't we speak on... That's so cool though, our character. We have a start of like, term like feast and there's sort of a to get to. Wonderful idea. As long as your young charge here doesn't mind me tagging along. Not at all, sir. After you. Ages hey, since I've been to the castle. Would be good to see the old pile of rocks. Anticipation for this game has been so crazy. Look at all the wands. I'm so excited. This game looks so creepy too. Glad I caught you before you left for Scotland. <laughs> Just barely. <laughs> And who is your traveling companion? A new student. New? Yes, sir. I'm starting school as a fifth year. How extraordinary. It is indeed. None of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to Hogwarts so late. Nor have I. Of course, as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years now, the headmaster asked if I could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term begins. Well, you couldn't have asked for a better mentor. Professor Fig is not only an exceptional teacher, he's also a remarkably intuitive and gifted wizard. Mr. Osric is prone to flattery. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the ministry. <laughs> have you seen this? I have. Opinions differ as to how great a threat Ranrock really is. Although I've yet to convince my colleagues at the Ministry, I believe he is a significant threat. And it was your wife, Eleazar, who alerted me to his activities months ago. Miriam? How? <sighs> she wrote to me about Ranrock before she died, wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Before I could respond, I received this. 
It was the last thing she sent me, Eleazar. It came to me via her owl. But with no correspondence, I can only assume... That she had to get rid of it quickly. To keep it safe. Presumably from Ranrock. I cannot open it. Whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed. It looks like goblin metal. That symbol. What's that glow? I don't see a glow. Nor do I. Merlin's beard. How did you wait? We do. Oh. already had a character killed off right in the like first like five minutes. Give me your hand. Wow, that was pretty intense. Are you all right? You're hurt. Perhaps a bit. Take this. It's Wigan World Potion. That stuff will write you in a second. Heal. Down arrow. Slam it. What happened? Poor George. I can't believe he... That what the hell got into that damn thing? Attacking a carriage mid-air? A typical dragon would never... Professor? Sir, where are we? I'm not sure. But that key you discovered was clearly a port key. Port key? An item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. I'm feeling better, sir, if you'd like to look around a bit. I would. But stay close. We've no idea who created this port key. Or why. Wizarded spells. I've had a cadaver. Nothing. Not yet. Okay, I gotta walk around first. Dang, look at how nice this looks, babe. Look at the like the sunlight coming to the screen. What is that? He take us farther from London than the carriage traveled. We're somewhere in the Scottish Highlands, sir. Those ruins. Do you the think port key was meant to lead us there? I do. This has not been the day either of us expected. But Miriam sent that port key to George for a reason. And I believe that she, and now George, died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right and wouldn't mind indulging me, I'd like to have a look around. Uh, absolutely, sir. Good. Let's see if we can find a path, however faded it may be. Can I beat up? Mind your step. Can I break these parts? Look, I have a one, I have a one now. Where do you suppose your wife got the port key that brought us here? A good question. Miriam spent years searching for evidence of a long-forgotten form of ancient magic. Ancient magic? Yes. A powerful magic wielded by a rare few that seems to have been lost to time.
Hogwarts Castle was built by and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. I don't know where she came into possession of the port key, but I am certain it was to do with that search. Yeah, the rest. Ah, that's the path down below. This way. Yeah. But sir, why was your wife searching for evidence of lost magic? Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding world. Spoke of the good it could do. But magic is no different than any power. What really matters is the one who wields it. I only have one. Fool, how many you had? Uh, is that ice? It's not cold enough here. Well, let's switch. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's yeah, see yeah, some of that hands, one word you were here. practicing. Yeah. Focus wipe on your hands. the center. Go wipe your hands. R2. Okay, I got a R2. Yeah, I know. Perfect. Excellent. Wipe your hands. You gotta pay attention here. You're battling. You're gonna. Uh, well, I'll be back because you're gonna have to battle soon. Mm. What? No, I can't bear it. Can't bear the save. Thanks for at least saving me four. Just eating some wings. Mm. You guys are messy. a bit rougher than I'd expected. Just ahead. I suspect they valued their privacy. That port key led us here for a reason. Let's have a look around for anything that seems out of place.
trying to go, man. Go back. Everywhere I look for stuff that's even out of place. Professor, this statue... This may have been his home! Professor, it's a mural of some kind. Mmm, perhaps our host was a noted seer. Interesting. Oh, you look oh, fast. Fast. Oh, not really out there. Just practicing my ear. That enchanted crystallized stone. Professor Fig! How odd! Why would someone have conjured that enchanted stone here? And how is there a room box? What room? I don't see anything. Yeah, maybe, maybe. There's that glow again. Sure. Like the glow on the port key Sweet. container. That's all we got, baby. Sweet. You didn't say anything. Oh, almonds. Almonds. Chocolate almonds. What? In Merlin's name? Godric's heart. What? Where are Look, we? Chocolate almonds? I don't oh, believe it. No. Oh. Hello? Uh, <laughs> I know. That's cool. <laughs> Welcome to Gringotts Wizarding Bank. Vault number 12, I presume. <laughs> Precisely. The key. Hmm? Your wife's porky. 
Oh, yes, of course. This way, then. Stay close. We haven't even got to Hogwarts yet. This is all happening before we even get to Hogwarts. After you. Inside the cart, if you don't wish to lose them. <laughs> oh, this is cool. Oh, the defense. Hundreds. In fact, we'll see quite the a few of them. We're only really playing that ride as we here. speak. We're just beneath the main lobby. Yeah. The vaults you see now are the newest. Are private entrances to the bank common at Gringotts? They are most uncommon. Only one with great wealth or power, or both, could have arranged for such a service. You want to take a breath? A what? That waterfall washes away all enchantments. It's a security measure. Experienced the thief's downfall before, have you? Heard of it? These are the lower vaults that we're passing now. How deep are we going? Vault so number 12 was cool. commissioned shortly after Gringotts was founded banks. over four centuries ago. It resides in the deepest part of the bank. Settle in. <laughs> we have quite a distance to go. Not even like if we haven't been in Hogwarts very long, we're all experiencing like the craziest 12th year ever. Our fifth year. Professor, mm -hmm. the old man that God was wearing was glowing. Like the glow you saw on the porky container. No, darker. I saw that same glow in the dragon's collar. Yeah, what was that? We were just wondering about that goblin back there. He watches over the oldest section of the bank. Rare anyone goes there anymore. Last time this vault was accessed. A goblin has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years. In that time, no one has visited Vault 12 until today. This is massive. This is crazy. Thank you for your help. Hello. Thanks for playing without me. I love playing my game with you. I'm gonna wait to play with you. I'm gonna wait to play with you. What do you suppose we should be looking for? I'm not sure. Sir, Sir, I wonder if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Wait! Best of luck. <sighs> Professor, that was certainly unexpected. Let me think. There must be something here. Hmm, Revelio, perhaps. Revelio? Yes, yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus.
Revelio. There, I saw something. Move a bit closer and try again. Revelio. A door. Well, that's a start. There's that symbol again. I don't suppose you see a way to... I do, Professor. That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw on the port key container. If what you can see reveals the way forward, then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. This is no ordinary vault. I suspect we will need to earn our way out of here. What do you mean, earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I do. But to what end, I can't say. Yeah, give me some Stay close. There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Not out of Gringotts. Something up ahead. Oh my god, my one. That glow again, but on the floor. Lumos! What happened? When I moved towards the glow, it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Are you all right? Yes, sir, I'm fine. You seem to have caused the floor to change. That statue? What statue? I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Revelio, I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. It is. The reflection's still there, but the statue's positions don't match. Wait. When you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm. Perhaps you should cast Lumos. Well done. Now the reflection is turning towards me. It does follow the light. Let me 
I need more powerful moves, dog. Oh, I'm supposed to be blocking. Professor Fig! Professor, where are you? This isn't good. Lumos, where am I supposed to go? What's happening? The wisps of magic seem to be leading me somewhere. Ah, that's where they're leading. I glow again. Rebellion. I suppose I'm on my own this time. Lumos. Seems I have no choice. I'm going to have to fight my way out of here.
Revelio. Rebellion. Floating above that basin. That is no mere basin. That is a pensive for viewing memories. I wonder. to see what others cannot will not be enough, Percival. We are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets, with knowledge others will do anything to obtain. Yes, and if we are correct, Charles, the witch or wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge and the responsibility that accompanies it. We've done all that we can. what you're seeing. The glow that surrounded them. Yes, sir. Astonishing. Can I see magic? Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed, but could never. Miriam, and perhaps George, Died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. And you, it seems, are the key to understanding why. We were. Someone's coming. Who were they? I don't know. But, sir, you shouldn't be in here. I was right. Ranrock. Seems my reputation precedes me. I was beginning to think no one was ever going to visit Rackham's Vault. And why are you here? No need for that. Just give me whatever it is you found here and we can let bygones be bygones. <coughs> Sir, they have the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I... I only meant that the instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must insist. I was to grant access only to one with the key, and you didn't have it. I have no patience for traitors. Now... Where were we? I'm not giving you anything. Mm. Well, 
Perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful. Are you all right? Fine, sir. I've never seen so powerful a goblin. He seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. Where are we? <laughs> it can't be. It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both, wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sword. Oh, 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 Hogwarts, baby! Da, 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 da. Yes! Yes! <laughs> Just the trail. The fucking game that was great. the sorting ceremony. I'm no expert, but that seems more appropriate. Now, I need to study this locket as soon as I can, but first I must contact the Ministry. They need to know what happened to George and Lee no. of Ranrock. For the moment, I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me. Of course, sir. Thank you. Ready for the sorting ceremony? to meet the headmaster. Fick, nice of you to join us. The sorting ceremony is over. There were complications. Complications? It seems the goblin in problem is... Goblins, I'm not trying to rumors, Fick, and I'm rapidly losing whatever patience I had left. If you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. I'll be in touch. <laughs> Professor Weasley, you've one more to be sorted. Welcome. You're just in time. 
Have a seat. A bit older than the others, aren't you? You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations. Classic. I'm looking forward to meeting my professors and learning all I can at Hogwarts. Indeed. Hogwarts has much to offer a dedicated student. And what you learn in class will prepare you for challenges outside the classroom as well. Mm. Sense of loyalty? I believe myself to be a true friend. I know I value that trait in others. Hmm. You do not give up easily, do you? You are undaunted by challenges that lie ahead. And your loyalty to a friend delayed your arrival here this evening. Perhaps you belong in Hufflepuff. Better be Hufflepuff! Oh, and one more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. Enough! It's not as though I've banned fans. I think that would like me for a second. I gotta go back and check that out. Don't tempt me. You are here to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I said, I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. Quite an entrance. It's lovely to meet you. I'm... Professor Weasley, would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As Deputy Headmistress, it is my distinct honor to show you to your common room. Right this way. It's quite uncommon for a student to begin as a fifth year. Might be a bit of work, but I'm sure that's never stopped you before. It hasn't, Professor. <laughs> now, here we are at the entrance to the Hufflepuff common room. This is the entrance. Indeed. I will explain what to do, but I hesitate to do it myself, as one errant knock leads to being doused in vinegar. Most unpleasant. You must tap the barrel, two from the bottom, middle of the second row, in the rhythm of Helga Hufflepuff. Well done. Now go on in and get some sleep. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. 
Sleep well. Looks like everyone's gone. Better head to the common room. Thank <laughs> you. 